Hello and welcome back to Code Buds with Narf. Yo. Yo. We're... I was realizing that we are uh, inspired. Oh right. All right. So let's let's see. Uh, what do you like to cook with? Uh. Well, we already got. We did end up getting our star apple vine wafer. Yeah. Uh. Honestly, even though I only have the one right now and I don't really need it, I kind of want to just pick up a. Um, this might actually turn out kind of fun. I usually just mess around with some of these things and. Aha! Oh my god, that's that's some that is some really decent blessed run, honestly. I mean, that's mashed lag doesn't have many options. Does so. it not? Doesn't have any. Nah, it usually curious. is plus four willpower. Mm. Uh. Still, you could have got the DV. You got the yeah, agility. We should, we should we preserve only... our yonder canes. Do we only have the one? Uh... Uh, salve? No, we've got oh, like oh, times we've, three here. We've only got we one could... blood stained one. Yeah. Uh, we were exploring a thingy in the. Uh, we got 52 pounds of books again. Yeah, we, we're probably heading out. Um, this is a new, a fresh recording session. I like to get that out there because then it explains some amnesia. Um, yeah, we're probably heading. Oh, is that sleep gas? Oh, god. <laughs> <laughs> just step on mines. Just, just, I just love the, the. I don't know. There's something like very cartoonish. It was like, psh, and then bang. Yeah. And, well, we are we are a rhinoceros. We gotta find ourselves a like a china shop. Yeah. What's the cut equivalent of a china shop? Like apothecary. Well, like I'm I'm thinking like uh something like um the tomb in uh, Eid Freehold. Oh, yeah. Or it's just, like, jars of... Uh... Jars everywhere, yeah. We got You got a lot of books. I do but have a lot of books. That's going to be a great payday. Oh, yeah, what can we throw down here? Oh, yeah, and we got an insane amount of rep from... Yeah. From that ruin. We got a ridiculous amount of rep from the ruin in the last episode. That took probably way longer than an episode should. What is a lacquered artifact that is giving you plus 82 reputation if you throw that down there? I don't know. We should find out, shouldn't we? The, the 80 rep for the gyrocopter backpack is, like, so tempting, but, like... Yeah. It, it just can't. I don't think I need it. Well, the, the, the We're up lava... to 32. The lava is too tempting. I throw like electro bows are such good fodder for the uh yeah, the yeah. Well. 38 uh, uh 40 some I don't know if I can justify the displacer bracelets cuz they're aren't they pretty good bits they're like quite good bits for yeah. the, uh, right. I mean at this point we mainly just need a little bit of rep I don't think we need that much Yeah We only need 14 more so I'm curious what that other weird artifact is. It's probably a gyrocopter backpack, but... Uh... It was a, <laughs> it was a Vine Reaper. It, no, no, no. I, I, I know. <laughs> one. I know. Oh, oh, a geomagnetic. We oh, are not nice. throwing that down the well. Yeah, that's quite good. We only have a solar cell, though. That's not gonna power many throws of a geomagnetic, but... We're short blades, so ruin diving isn't as isn't as good, but still pretty good. Oh, We've got one fix-it spray foam. We can fix it. Are you gonna, are you gonna disassemble it? I mean, we could also just pick up repair. So, this is a skill that keeps coming back to haunt me, because I actually rarely take it. Yeah, neither um, do I. But like, it kept coming up in Galen's run, and eventually we did take it, and it did yeah. actually prove to be useful. But, like, I don't know. I don't take any skill that is made redundant with, like, a, a 12 dram item. Get that, get them salt dunes. Yeah, I usually end up buying all the wayfarers. I question... All right, so, uh, 14 more. 14 uh, more. Fungus... Oh, yeah, you like, the, you like the fungicide grenades. I like to hold on to one. Um... We don't need a compass bracelet. We don't need a flaming iron dagger. If you throw that down, does it also throw the solar cell down? Yeah, but I think we get the credit for that too. Or no, probably not, because it's. I should probably unload those, huh? That's a I good found, point. 
I found out pretty recently just how valuable solar cells are. They're on the they're on the high end. It's surprising. Yeah. Oh, we do have a glow sphere now. So four, 16. 16. We need sixteen. Stun gas grenades are useless. We'll throw those down. Uh, a compass bracelet. That's four. Flaming iron dagger. Five. Wow, the solar cells worth seven. Twelve. Uh thirteen. We need another one pointer or a two pointer. Alright, mm. fine. You can take the fun just a second. <laughs> nice. I thought it was at 300. Is it not at 300? Honestly, it might be at 250. You might already be okay. Yeah. Yeah, all right. That's fine. We've got 300 now. Well, as long as we're here in the stilt, we might as well go shopping. Everyone will have reset. But this one was gunsmith, glo glover, pig farmer, and armorer. <laughs> I'm just reading from the uh, goat herder, glover, gunsmith, glover. Uh... Gunsmith, armorer, apple farmer, pig farmer. Wow, this is bad. Yeah. Cat herder, apple farmer, amoeba farmer, and chef. What does the cat farmer sell? And why is it a pig? Whoa. Okay, so the chef is mad at me. Why is the chef mad at you? Because I had beguiled her. Though she shouldn't have ended up angry at me for it. He, I guess. Uh. Okay, fine. Well, We're they eventually... Gonna... Uh... Lose their aggro. We're just gonna do a little corner dance there. Come over here and see if she's still mad. I'm not seeing a red dot. I think she ended up in the. In the other yeah, tile. We... Oh, okay. okay. She's all right now. Sleep beard. Yeah, it's probably worth picking up some of these glands now. I don't. I don't sleep on the uh, con unconcentrated anything anymore. I don't. I do question. I don't know how good the soul curd is, but I guess is isn't. It's just like better. Um, like. Congealed soul curd is uh soul curd is congealed gubernos. Uh, as far as I know, it doesn't offer any regenerative properties. Like you can't regenerate your arm for cooking with soul curd. Yeah, I don't think you can. That would be pretty good though. Like every time, like a spine fruit jam soul curd. Every time you take damage, you have a chance of regenerating a limb. I'm gonna give her the cap of the plastic nomad, just cause. Every time you regenerate a limb, you have a chance of having flame beard. Yeah. Fire. Ooh. What were you doing? Uh, the bone meal. Yeah, the bone meal is pretty good. Get that 80. I don't really need to buy the congealed blaze. We have some. We don't yeah. have that much. Wow, that's a very empty. As far as I know, um, I don't know if this is spoilers or not, but like, there's no way to get bone meal outside of the Tomb of the Eaters, right? I don't think so. Oh, hey, feather. Without buying it. Nanon. No, I can't remember what Nanon does. This member oh. on pen, but it's a it's a decent one. How is that different from serrated? Uh, it goes on different things. Oh. Uh -huh. Serrated only goes on bladed weapons. Uh -huh. Can you put Nanon on a on a bludgeon on a cudgel? I think you can put it on like uh, ranged weapons. Oh. I don't know though. Don't quote me on that. We could sell off the traveling rod, though. We don't need to. We have a bunch of. Uh, Could get rid of your second basic toolkit just to shed some weight. Oh yeah, I saw that. That was me joking, by the way. Uh, I'd, I'd shed like I would probably throw away all the copper nuggets. Yeah, I was gonna say I think it's copper nuggets. Cause that's like seventeen pounds right there. Yeah. Oh wow, that that worked out perfectly. Good lord. Yeah. I don't know why I went to the apothecary, but I did. Got a Hulk, honey. Oh, look Ooh. at all the lore. Oh, he had a neutron flux. Yeah. God damn. Ixer Mask the second challenge the legitimacy over an ordinance. I think we saw this one. Practice of cleaving skulls. Yeah. Oh, Rush F lore, you can learn that by playing Caves of Cud. At a remote college, Ixer Mask authored the account that evoked the presence of the wintry miniature glacier. She named it Friend of Glacier. I think we can do that one too. I like Friend of Glacier. Yeah. I kind of hate that Beguiling runs the risk of getting negative reps, so we'll come back there in a second. Um, Did we pass on making friends with the Pope because of their reputation? I don't remember. Because I'm wondering Why? if it... Well, because we could go and learn proselytize, and then you have a free... You could just try and proselytize them. This is true. 
reputation with me mechanics is uh, pretty easy to. Wait, is this not a fl is this not a glow sphere level light? Like it does not shed light. Oh no, <laughs> I hate when that happens. <laughs> it's not even a glow sphere. I I had that happen to me before, and it was with a thing called like the glowy glow sphere of shining brightness, and it was like <laughs> and it didn't it didn't shed, shed a damn even one radius. We'll just checkpoint. All right, so where is Love Vine Wafer and the favorites cook? All right, let's drink some water. Oh, you're, we'll you're see okay. See how this works. What's up? Oh, I, I we're we're uh, we're committing to the beguiling. Nice. Well, it, you know, if it's stupid and it works, it ain't it ain't stupid. <laughs> it has really like nothing. Yeah, I'm not even gonna bother stealing the rest of that. Well, actually, I'll take these. Uh, no. Direct to stay there. And then we might as well set another checkpoint here. And then uh, whip up a... Uh, not whip a meal. Use ingredients. If only you could share... You could do a water ritual with lesser creatures. Um, hey, look at that. That's pretty good. Plus one AV permanently. Well, you just cooked with it? Yeah. I mean, I guess uh, I guess when we're setting checkpoints, that makes sense. I mean, even when we aren't, it makes sense. It's only a 10% chance to start over. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> um... I uh, I guess I just don't have the heart to do that. I had a like I I've ended know. a few stream runs like that. It's super fun. <laughs> I I found out some like next level um, cooking dice roll shenanigans the other day that was not beneficial, but it is good to know. Um, and it went something like I use a Sphinx salt injector. I was trukin to look ahead yeah. and see that the cooking with neutron flux was fine. Yeah. But then for unrelated reasons... But then it wasn't? No, yeah. no, no, it was... You cooked something else? Yeah. No, 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 I, I didn't cook anything else. I died. For unrelated reasons, I had died. Went oh, yeah. back to the checkpoint. I was like, well, I already know the neutron flux is good. Cooked the meal, and then it wasn't good. Yeah. So... Because it wasn't the same, like, setup for the seed. Yeah, I guess the dice roll is yeah. only true when you precognition it, but it's not true... It's not the same when you go to, like, I don't know, set it, uh, go back to the checkpoint. So, uh, we should probably go do Golgotha. Yeah. We still haven't, we still haven't done Golgotha. Level 17, and we haven't gold the Golgotha, we haven't gold the Gotha. I usually wait till I have, like, 100 hit points till I come here. Makes sense. Sure, we'll go use the campfire that's already here. All right. Which, uh, I'll take direction from you, which, uh. Let's go bottom left. Bottom left, shoot. All right. I never go bottom left, but... It's blessed run. It doesn't matter. The, we'll just uh, do my normal strat for getting through. I mean, electric isn't bad. I'd take electric. It's a, it's a, it's a little spicy, but I love the animation for jumping. So good. Okay, this is that. Yeah, this is bad. Maybe. And we're hungry. We don't we don't have that AV bonus anymore. I mean, we're, what do you mean anymore? That's permanent, yo. Oh, right. I, I, in my head, I was like, oh, you cooked with bone meal. Oh, no, no. Yeah, that's perfect. I mean, <laughs> yeah, oozing, dazed, no sore throat, no Jasper. How are you recovering in front of oozes like that? We're friendly with oozes because we're, of the... Oh my god! We're friendly with... I've never been friendly with oozes and then gone to Golgotha. That's amazing. Yeah, th this is the most inspiring place to cook a mouth-watering meal I've <laughs> ever seen. only we were also friends with mollusks this would just be oh wow right in front of you huh that sucks okay i i guess i guess we're fine we're still inspired oh Ooh. <laughs> are we jumping mm, we can't see that spot are we fighting this log ah uh, why do you see me there There we go. That was nice. Uh, that was a clever maneuver there. I hadn't actually considered that one. What? Well, because um, they're less likely to want to hang out on uh, water or liquid yeah. tiles, right? Yeah. So you got them to, to go onto the one tile that you had melee. Uh, uh. He was hitting pretty hard there. Yeah, slug hit hard. You ate congealed self. Oops. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's pretty good injured we probably got this yeah we're fine we stunned him a double muscled working out for us Oof. yeah the poison all right so we're poisoned again and the cell wore off right yeah 
I'm going to take another cell. Even though this fight is over. Oh, he died. Yes. But we're still going to take damage from poison for a minute. I hate poison. I kind of want to do a tutorial video that call covers all recovery items. Because I think there's a, a genuine technique to when to use all of them, like timing wise. Yeah. Well. Might as well get that poison resistance, given how much we hate poison. So how many creatures do you know of that actually like can poison? Like, uh, a couple of very annoying ones. The Scorpion. Yeah. Uh, I feel like ninety percent of them are in the in the Golgotha. Yeah. Honestly, I opt for a petition for more poisoning creatures in good. You know, only to justify uh, this slog oh, hey. and unculus. The people of Omenport saw an image on the horizon and looked like a... Oh, that's a Russia floor. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, a settlement. Oh, we learned the location of a settlement. We did, yeah. Yeah. Goat folk village. Haunt. Is there... Um... Gotta love trash divining. It's like one of my favorite skills. I, yeah, I... I, I... Right. I also kind of love getting mumble mouth for the same reason. Yeah, mumble mouth, mumble mouth, and salt dunes, salt dune uh, combing is like a favorite pastime. I haven't got, I have, I still haven't done like an all fungal run. I want to do an all fungal run. All right. Well, as long as we're here, we might as well cook with some like weird nasty shit, right? All right. Let's well, let's see what you mean. Uh, I don't know. We didn't really have any. Uh, we should not drink with ooze. No. I figured we that's... learned that from the tutorial video. <laughs> by, uh... Actually, I kind of want to try something weird. Just see what it comes up with. It'll be like whenever you eat a mushroom, you teleport. Oh, there you go. Whenever you mm. take avoidable damage, 20 to 25% chance you teleport. Oh, that's a nice one. I mean, yeah. it, it's a nice one in that um, it will be a disaster. <laughs> yeah, this one's pretty cool, though. Yeah, that's that's really good. And I mean, there's no chance to that. Like, it just works. So you basically yeah. get like a really nice teleport skill. Yep. Just, uh, just caves of. Oh, hey, stuff, like... an extra great gate recorder that we can just immediately disassemble. I like to like a comic book esque envision these scenarios where like your dude is surrounded by like fifty All dudes. Right, it's like, so I'm gonna eat this mushroom real, real quick. We got, we got some water. So, uh, clean all of your items. Step off of that pool of goop, and then. Water. We're too goopy. Uh, pour on yourself one gram. Uh, I was hoping that would get rid of the. Okay. Are we done? Are we done gooping? I think we're done. I think gooping. we're done gooping. Yeah. All right. I don't like to bring the goop back to Great Gate. I try my best not to. Oh, that's interesting. And if I do bring it back, I find a way to get like you know flame breath and go over and melt it. You can just collect it. Yeah, but it's so much easier to melt it. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> What do you do with it after you collect it? I I go and find somewhere I want to dump it on. That's a decent glove. I don't know that I want to pay for it, though. I want to find one. But let's figure out what that... Oh, well, actually, you I already can just have pay one. you to tell me what it is. Oh. I already have a plastifer glove? No, I was going to say you already oh, had a smoky tube. Oh, I have that smoky tube. Ooh. I, I, I don't yet have a working memory of what tier uh, each... Which tier is which, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's what the the no. Do they are they like um, the security cards? Do like does a higher tier unlock all lower tiers? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you could you could if you get the if you got the highest tier you would only need the one yeah. card. Oh, I was gonna ask you about heirlooms in Cud. Yeah. Besides um, the spoiler quest, which I won't spoil, uh, is there any? Do you know of any ways of like reliably? getting heirlooms like is there actually any mechanical or functional way of finding heirlooms i don't think so uh there was something i was looking at and being like we could sell that if we wanted to recompass bracelet <laughs> oh yeah oh, that's why you took the the small trinket wait you sold them no i identified them oh they were desalination pellets so that's like i i, I there's a way of making money with with those right because we can like what desalinate um, brackish water, and then it's just water. Well, yeah, but you can also desalinate other things. Uh, but I I usually just grab them because they're zero weight, 
and it's nice having them no oh. when you need them you can you can like because you need desalinated gel for fungal cure right oh, yeah i just just simply do not you. get fungled <laughs> oh man i don't know if we're not all right fine Uh, we're, I believe we're neither, right? Oh, you are high agility. How are we not using yeah. something? Uh, because it hasn't mattered yet. Right. We haven't spent the points in it. Just need some, uh, wings, and then this, this run's gonna pop yeah. off. Ooh, spiked. I like spiked. You could go farm wings. All right, let's do some shopping. Cute girl, where are you? Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh... Combustion cell is kind of cool to get. I don't really have any money to buy the thingy from you, but actually, hold on over here. Can you do that quest step thing for me? Yeah, cool. All right. Auto explore, pick up all the loot that it lets us. I found there's a um, there's a rock tumbler. Oh, nice. In uh, Eid. In Eid, Eid. For... Yeah. And uh, they just like let you take the stones out of it, but also then you can just like start grinding put, your stones. Yeah, you put your rough stones in it. And I, I did that the other day for the first time because of uh, of our, our previous session. Yeah. All right, so we got that quest. We are now at the point where Onwards. we want to... Straight to Bethesda Sousa, right away. Do other things. Why would we do that? <laughs> Uh, we're actually pretty close. If I remember correctly. Go and learn dual wielding from Bela, and then, uh, and then our handy, handy lad will... Unshelled reptiles don't care about us. So, we're pretty good with unshelleds, but... I don't Here. know, we could comb, we could comb some desert. We could do Bela, we haven't done Bela. Is that... That's deep jungle. Isn't it? What? No, that's just regular jungle. Yeah. Parad. We could Earth do Parad. roost of science scientists. I I like another historic uh, site. The historic sites have been kind of blessed. Yeah, I do like my historic sites. We've also got one out here in the mountain. Oh, I do love. Or a potentially mountain. the. There's two of them. Oh yeah, Mipir and uh, Tarash. We could go because we haven't gotten uh we haven't gotten to Ezra yet either, but I think. Yeah, let's head over towards... Sure. Oh. Oh, hey. This is going to be Naphtali, right? Yeah. We are also in uh, potential... Uh... Oh, hey. Ixer Mouse 5 learned looted a boot that evoked the presence of a colossal helmet. He named it the Triumph of Helmet. <laughs> helmet is just an entire faction. You got, you got uh, spooky snap jaws. Nice. Psionic weird artifact. Yeah. yeah. Ouch. Oh, so we got we got a seed sower. Oh, nice. I hate sowers. No, one of the best things to do is just throw shit back at them if you can't get within melee easily. What do you mean? Like, what 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 would you throw back at them? Uh, sower seeds. I oh, mean, I see. You mean like grenades? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, howler. Light obfuscating lens. Yeah, I'm not sure what that's for. Oh, I should probably eat something. It's set set a checkpoint too. I mean, yeah, we are playing Dark Souls mode and stuff. Heck yeah. Could probably use one of my recipes, but I don't feel like we really need it. Oh, wait. Interesting. Oh. Interesting. I was, I was thinking for a moment that was um, Borokoro, but no, it's a different <laughs> legendary ape. He looked like he netted himself. Yeah, he accidentally hit himself. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing but net. Oh, that's a nice... I mean, it's obviously worthless, but it's a nice find. <laughs> Legendary life sap. That's uh, kind of spicy. Oh, there's there's your sprog. Ah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'd be tempted to make friends with that lad. For what? Um, Sightless of the Seeker's Way rep and Kyokyukya rep. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, it's uh, the thing. We are, I mean, you're a mutant, so um, reputation with the Sightless Way can actually be pretty good, as I understand it. I can't remember why, though. They're like, what? What's up? Oh, I, I, you're just, you're doing things that I have never done. Hold on. You, so you, you gave up uh, a ton of Kyakuka reputation to learn some secrets. Yeah, I mean, what else am I going to do with Kyuki on Grip? Um, I don't know. I guess we already learned cooking and gathering from it, right? 
Yeah. That's probably the best thing you can do with the with that. So what did we did we learn anything good? Uh, we got a couple of goat folk villages. Um, uh, but I mean, I I don't think you can from Kyukia. Can you do anything interesting with like goat folk villages? Like I always wonder if I'm. Well, you can trade those secrets to quite a few factions. Oh. The location of goat folk villages are. Uh, <laughs> he netted the sorry the beetle, beetle bum. Sorry beetle bum. <laughs> that was quite the hallway. Oh, a mimic. I love a mimic. That's a rare, like, mimic in their actual form. Yeah. Mimic that never bothered to mimic anything. Yeah. Lazy mimic. Turned into a couch potato. We are getting a ton of secrets out of, uh, trash. This game. Oh, we already made it up. We did our made our friend. Oh, you actually go and investigate Go Folk Villages? Well, you learn the location when you hit it, and then you can just hit the map again. It, Though, it, actually, I think, uh, I don't know how far we're in where we are, but it would be a good time to do a break. Yeah, that's a good idea. Um, if you are enjoying this series, definitely hit that like button. Consider subscribing for more content like this, and we'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.